Hi, it's me again with Corel Draw Tips and Friend uh, Tips and Tricks. And a friend of mine sent me this file, and he says whenever he enlarges something, it changes to blue. Well, that is just Corel's way of letting you see what it's going to look like compared to the original one. And then when you click off of it, it goes back. So that's really what I'm trying to answer with the question. But I thought I'd kind of this could be a tricky, it's a pretty neat squiggle or flowery you got. But you have to think about when you're doing this that you've got to keep the letter. The letter, the top of the letter is the most important part. So if you take your virtual segment delete key, and I would just, and if you hold down your alt key, I would just take out the inner parts of the squiggle because you can't really do anything else with them you've got to keep the letter you've got to keep the integrity of the letter to show up and then you can take your virtual segment delete key and delete these other lines that make up the, the floral and you just got to be thinking about I mean, if you think about it, you've got to keep the integrity of the letter, the shape of the letter entirely. The squiggle is still going to show through. And I'll show you here in just a second what it looks like when it's done. He didn't ask me to do this. I think I feel confident he can. Just a little bit more. Because if you don't, if you don't think about saving the letter, you can cause, you can really run into problems trying to figure out what to do. I think I've got it. So now let's zoom in and take the Smart Fill tool and fill in the letter. And that's what your cutout's going to look like. That's pretty cool. So you would just need to do that for both sides. And Mike, just for your instance, the file you sent me, this part was not any good. So I flipped it over and put it on that side. So he's going to do the same thing on the bottom. But his question was about the blue. And it was concerning him. But that's just Corel's way of showing you what it's going to look like before you click off of it. It's going to be a pretty neat, neat, neat design. If you need any more help, just holler. Hope that helped a little bit. Thank you for watching.